Hey, good Saturday morning. Great to be with you here on the last day of April. May starts tomorrow. We've got a lot going on this weekend. It's starting to get to the time of year where we get these warmer temperatures on these weekends and we just keep packing these weekends full. Uh, but this morning we've got a couple little isolated showers and one severe thunderstorm warning. We'll kind of go a quick tour from north to south to kind of hit everyone. Northwest Arkansas, we had a cell earlier this morning. That's now pushed way off east of Eureka Springs. Uh, we're now dry in Bentonville, Springdale Rogers and Fayetteville. We've got one more little pop up. This is right over Lake Ten Killer, south of Tahlequah. It's going to be moving into uh, Adair County here shortly. Westville, we may get a quick downpour for us. This is probably going to track north and east, kind of skimming Fayetteville, Springdale and Rogers here in the next hour, hour and a half. This one's small. We'll have to see if it grows a little bit, but we're probably going to struggle with some of these cells back towards the west because that front is just about to clear on through. We've got one good healthy thunderstorm though in eastern Oklahoma. This is Latimer County heading into western portions of Lafleur. So here's Poto. We're not including in this warning at the time, at this moment. This thing is kind of moving just barely south of due east. So Wilberton, we're trying to wrap up with some of the light hail that we picked up. Red Oak, we're next. This is taking a look at the hail tracker that we've had. It's so far kind of weakening over time. So it was a little bit heavier over Wilberton, but this hail pocket coming into Red Oak, here's Lake Worcester. We'd be next if it continues to hold, but it is showing some signs of weakening, which is good news. But here's the latest on the timing. Fanshawe, uh, about 6.30 or so here in the next 15 minutes. Hevener, 7.07, so we have just under an hour to go. I think in Poto, we should be fine. We're probably going to get some rain on and off, though, out of this storm, but the most of the hail should be south of us. But if it got close, it'd be just before the seven o'clock hour, but that rain is coming in just on the other side of Cavanaugh Hill. It's gonna be moving in shortly too. Tallahena, we're getting some rain on and off this morning. Fort Smith, Van Buren, we're, we're actually good. We're kind of in between some pockets, right? We've had some cells north of us. We've got some cells south of us. Now we could get a sh stray shower this morning, but it'd be quick and light. And then I think we'll move on later throughout the day. We'll continue to warm up. It's already not a bad start. We're sitting in the 60s and 70s, area wide, a light southeasterly breeze. Once that front pushes on through, we'll have a west wind, but it's not gonna be a very cold west wind, but it's gonna be a dry west wind. It's gonna knock out the humidity. It's kind of muggy right now. That'll change the rest of the day. Here's your timeline for the start of this weekend. Rain taking place now, but we're wrapping all that up as showers continue to dwindle. Of course, we've got that one cell coming into the floor. We'll track it, but the majority of us at this time, when you think of Fort Smith and Fayetteville and Bentonville and Clarksville, our chances for rain will continue to wane. They're not completely over until about lunch, but most of us should start to dry out here the next couple of hours. And as we do, the sun's gonna come out. We've got a great day. We've got that rain coming into Poto, but even later for us, that sun's gonna come out. We're gonna warm up to the mid 70s, maybe mid to upper 70s in the Floor County and, and Fort Smith and Clarksville and Boonville. It should be a great Saturday. And we'll continue this nice weather into Sunday too. So we're just wrapping up the rain, pushing it on out, on and off here. Not everyone's getting a lot of rain either. Some of us got a good downpour and then some of us barely have anything. It's just how it goes this morning. That dry west wind comes in for the afternoon. Uh, and then we'll warm up with that sun. It's going to feel nice. We've got more rain chances, though, underway. We're going back into an active pattern. This weekend looks good after this morning's rain. But Monday and Tuesday, more chances for severe storms come up. Now, this is Monday severe threat, Tiffany. Most of the strongest thunderstorms should be in central Oklahoma, but we could get clipped in parts of northwest Arkansas with a level two risk north of Fayetteville. Between Fayetteville and Fort Smith, we're under that level one. Of course, that's Monday, so we've got a couple days to wrestle with that forecast. But enjoy this weekend. Starting off with a few light showers here and there in clouds, but the sun is going to come out. We should have a nice end to April, nice start to May. In the River Valley, we'll have clouds for a few more hours before the sun comes out for us, too. Hey, the sun will come out sun tomorrow. Come out. Isn't should that a song? Sing it? Yeah, it is a song. I'll spare you all from <laughs> singing you. it. Because Ruben does not spare us he from does singing not it. Oh, he, brings, spare it. he starts playing in the background, like there a karaoke go. session. We won't do it today. You don't want that. We don't want it. No. I mean, I think I'm a great singer. You guy. may want it. No, I, I don't. don't. I'm, I'm You're like, please there. spare me. I haven't slept much. <laughs> yeah, I get it, Matt. I get it. Don't want you dreaming about it tonight. <laughs> for sure. All right. Well, thanks for that, Matt.